Hi guys, welcome back. So today we're going to be doing another mock spread. I've got a brand new kit that's coming out today. But before we get on with the mock spread, I wanted to let you guys know of a giveaway that I'm having. And it's for a full kit of the Brew Crew. And also you will receive a Halloween countdown. So it counts down from October all the way down to Halloween. And you'll receive both of these for free. All you have to do is go over to my Etsy shop and favorite my shop. You don't have to purchase anything. It's just like a little giveaway, but all you need to do is favorite my Etsy shop and then I'm gonna randomly pick a winner. I'm gonna be doing it next week and then posting it off at the end of next week. So that way you will have it in time. So this is a two page countdown and then here is a full kit. So it's a six page kit. And if you are interested in receiving one of these for free, then all you have to do is just favourite my Etsy shop. So going back to our mock spread, if you're not sure what a mock spread is, it's kind of fake plans, if you like. This isn't a real page in my planner. This is actually October last year's um, sheets, but I'm just using it to show you my new kit and how you could use it. So last week, I think it was, I put up a mock spread and it was on the uh, Me Time kit. And I've also done a mock spread on Wednesdays we wear pink but I didn't film this one and I didn't put it up on my channel but this one is up on my channel. The kit that's coming out today is this kit right here and it's called uh, Well Groomed. I thought there was not enough male kits in the market and especially if you've got a partner's birthday or you just want to celebrate a male themed week then there just was not enough kits designed for men. So I decided to do this one right here it's called Well Groomed. So here are all of your full boxes and then you have eight half boxes, four quarter boxes, two bill dues, two habit trackers and some page flags. You've got headers, littles, a cancelled, nope, rescheduled, a to buy checklist and then these checklists here, they're not heart checklists because hearts aren't very manly. So I decided to do the kind of target symbols. So you've got target checklists. And then you've got your ombre checklist here. These have got hammers on, scissors, spanners, and then these are like beard trimmers, which I thought was quite funny, so I decided to do those. And then you've got your weekend banner, which looks like a barber's shop, if I zoom you in here. And then it's got the, oh, camera's not gonna focus. Then it's got the barber's utensils on there as well. You've got your icons, some deco, a weekly box, two long page flags, and then date covers. And then the last page is your solid washi, patterned washi, and your bottom washi. And that is this kit. Let me just zoom you back out. There we go. And more excitingly, news, I found my hobby craft card. It was actually in my purse. I don't know why I didn't look in there the first time. Um, so let's get on and just start. So I'm going to start with the bottom washi as always. And I'm thinking I might actually just put this down at the bottom. I know it's like really thick, but I could trim the bottom off a little bit. Because I don't want to put it up here and then put the date covers on and cover it up. And I'm not going to rip any stickers this week. I'm going to take them off nice and slow. Because <laughs> I seem to be ripping stickers a lot lately. So I think I might trim the bottom off then. Shall I do that? I mean, we could put it all the way up. I'll just lose a little bit of space. No, I think I'm going to trim a little bit. So put this down here. And then at the top here, I can put some washi down before I put my date covers down. I think I might do that. Uh, I need to try and half match this up really. Down. I saw the new releases of the new Happy Planners today. I was watching it, there was like a YouTube video. There are so many really pretty ones coming out and I can't decide which one I'm going to be getting because I need to get myself another one. I'm not sure when you can buy them in the UK actually. I don't think it's said on there when we'll be able to get them in the UK but I'm going to keep looking. Okay, so that's my bottom washi done. Um, I'm going to do the date covers. Oh, I'm going to put some washi down first just to cover up these bigger dates because that just does not go with my kit. So I'm going to use these two washies. So one is like a silver and one is a black. 
they're kind of manly. Okay, so that is all of the washi done top and bottom so I'm just going to quickly stick the date covers on. These date covers have got little moustaches on. So cute. So as I was saying I did see the new releases of the Happy Planners which are coming out. There were some really nice ones. Um, there were some nice kind of pattern ones that I really really liked and then the coil was like bright pink and I don't really want a bright pink coil. I just wanted a normal coil and then the ones that had like the rose gold coils and the kind of more plain coils were I didn't like the pages <laughs> so it's like I liked some pages on one but not the coil and I liked the coil on some and not the pages so I have no idea what ones I'm gonna go for but I need to figure it out because I need to order one soon And then, same as I did with my bullet journal kit, I've left here plain so you can write in the dates rather than do date dots. Because if I do date dots, I then have to take something out of the kit to be able to fit them in. So I thought I would leave it so you can just write it in yourself. Did I just line them up in the wrong place? I did. That's okay. I lined them up with the bottom black line and I was supposed to line them up at the top. Let me see if I can figure this out. That's better. Okay. So I'm definitely going to be using this kit in my planner when it's my partner's birthday, which is in February. Unless I've got another kit out by then, or I see a kind of male themed kit, then I will grab it. Okay. I'm just gonna quickly switch these around because I don't know what I was thinking. There we go. Okay. So that is the date covers done. Let's do the headers. How did I do todays or to-dos at the top? I've done todays, but I think I'll do to-dos this time when I can find the headers sheet. Nope. There they are. So I don't plan like this usually in my planner, but I know a lot of people do, which is why I set up my mock spreads this way. So then you guys can see my kit in the style that maybe you plan in. And I'm filming these because I'm going to be doing them anyway, because I want to keep a record of all the kits that I've done. Oh look, I ripped a sticker. How unusual of me. That's fine. That's fine. Get all these to do's down. I can't believe we're nearly at the end of September. Like, September has just flown by. I think because the kids have gone back to school and we've been busy with back to school things that it's just gone. There's hardly any time left. But then on the other hand, it's kind of nice because, oh, this is crooked. Um, I love Halloween so much. It's one of my favorite times of the year. And usually, like on my channel, when before I was doing planner videos, I'd done a lot of beauty videos and Halloween was just the best thing. I'd done so many different Halloween looks. So if you guys are looking for any makeup Halloween-y looks, then definitely check out my channel because I have done lots. 
Okay, I'm going to move on to the checklist. I'm going to put them all along the top. I might just go in this order here. So then I've used like one of each, I think. So I'm going to leave a little bit of a gap. Put them down here. Oh, my phone. So every year we um, have a Halloween party and we kind of alternate whose house it is at. So one year it's at mine, one year it's at my parents and one year it's at my sister's. And we all dress up and we have a trophy that's um, for the best dressed. And we've had the same trophy, I don't know how many years it is now. It's quite a few years and then whenever you win you put the year and then who obviously won the trophy. We've got it downstairs at the moment. I'm, I can't remember who won it last year. I think it was my daughter who won it last year. Um, she had done half a teddy bear on her face. I mean, it doesn't sound very scary, but it was kind of gory. It was kind of really, actually really cool. Uh, she loves Halloween as well, and she loves SFX makeup. So I definitely have some competition when it comes to Halloween. Um... But we can't dress up too crazy and too scary because we've got younger children. Like my nieces and nephews are a little bit younger than my children. And I think the youngest is five, so we can't go too crazy and scary. Um, right. So I'm just going to put the Today headers in. Uh, hang on a minute. So this is the trophy right here. It's nothing like spectacular. Um, it just says best costume. And we've been doing it since 2008. And then these are all the people that have won it so far. I am on there, I'm up here. Um, I'll try and find a picture of my daughter because she won it last year. And put it in right here so you can see. But yeah, it's a lot of fun. We've been doing it for a, a long, long time. And my auntie also has like a um, little Halloween get together and that's like the whole family. I've got quite a big family and we're all really close so when it's like a family get together there are 20 plus people. Um, so it's always really fun. But yeah, so I love Halloween and I kind of really want to go and watch the It movie. Um, I watched the original like when I was younger and it frightened the hell out of me. So I kind of want to go and um, see this one. My daughter wants to see it. She's 15 though and I'm like, uh, I don't think so. But she actually likes scary movies and jump scares. and I'm like a wuss when it comes to scary movies. I will literally have a pillow in front of me and have my hands over my ears. <laughs> I'm really bad. Um, so I end up not watching probably 80% of the movie because I'm just hiding behind a pillow. I just can't take it. I don't like it. I think it depends what movie it is because I don't really like gore and I hate anything to do with um, ghosts and children and being possessed and weird things. Yeah, I'm just a wuss. I much prefer Disney movies. Plus, my partner is the type of person to watch a scary movie in the complete dark. Like, no lights on, maybe have a candle on, and it I just can't, I can't cope. So a lot of the movies he will watch by himself. Like, I only watched, I think, the I know I watched the first one of Saw. Uh, maybe I watched the second one, and I was like, I don't like this. So then he watched all the other ones on his own. But he said they weren't that great. My headers are all wonky because I'm talking. I'm sorry, but let's carry on and put the full boxes down. So I'm going to leave this one here, which says it's called Style for the top. And I'm just going to randomly pick ones. Oh, Lord. Uh, mm, we'll go with this one. I think this is why my plan with me takes so long because I'm just indecisive and I can't decide what to do. Okay, let's do this one. 
this one, the little bag says, a perfectly manly bag to put pens and charges and other guy stuff. I don't think I'm quite with it today. I've been working more on this secret project that I kind of half mentioned in my um, Monday's plan with me. I'm so excited for you guys to see it. I hope you guys like it. But I'm not going to keep talking about it because I can't tell you all what it is. <laughs> I'm just very excited. Um, let's do this one. I don't know why I struggled so much drawing um, men in particular because they're no different to women it's just I struggled and when I was I drew a couple that were not that had their face in like I would with females um, I'm trying to think where's my oh, here. so where I drawn like girls I drew some men like that and I was like, I think this is a little bit weird to be sticking men into your planner. I'm not sure people will like that. So that's why I decided not to keep them ones in. I just changed them out and done like this flat lay one and I'd already done this one. I think it was this one. Um, yeah. Because some people can be, not picky, but a bit funny, I suppose, when you're choosing your kit and most of the people base it on the full kits on the full boxes and they don't like to have lingerie or they don't like to have um, anything that's not I don't want to say normal but I'm just going to put my little headers down I don't want to offend a lot of people that's what I'm trying to say sometimes when I think of kit ideas and I'm like oh well, that would be really good and then I'm like oh that People might not like it or people might find that offensive so yeah but hopefully people don't find the mail kit offensive <laughs> or weird because sometimes we need to plan around men in our life not all the time but sometimes especially if it's someone's birthday I try to do something that's based around what they like so for my middle son's birthday, I done a Pokemon spread. Now, I'm not a Pokemon person. This isn't my usual kind of kit, but it was something that he was really into. So every time I look at that, I know it's his birthday week without even knowing the date. So, yeah. Okay. I do actually really like the colour palette that I chose. I feel it's very masculine, but at the same time, you could use this throughout autumn and winter. So, yeah. Oh, I'm just, all of my headers are crooked today, okay? We're having a crooked header day. If I get it all out now, then it won't be like that in my actual plans on Monday. <laughs> Okay, so let's move on to little things. So I'm going to find my full boxes and some washing, in case you want that. And my icons. Oh, let's put the weekend banner in because I pretty much always forget to do that. So where do I want to put it? Should I put it down here? I could put it up here and just cover up the first... Can I do that? We've done it now. Okay, that's the weekend. So I'm just gonna put some I'm just gonna put some full boxes down here. Um yeah, so I'm not picky, but I know what I like and I use what I like as well as every other planner will use what they like. So it's not that people are picky, it's just you know. It's hard to please everybody, so I'm hoping some people like this kit and they don't find it offensive. That was my goal. Okay, so I'm going to use these kind of marbly ones, I think. I'm just going to put a full box down here. And I might put a 
grey one on Wednesday. I could put it like here. Yeah, I'll put it down here. Like this. Where else could we put a box? Maybe on Friday. I'm going to put it this way. Should I put some washi behind it? I think so. Let's do the dark blue. Put that down here. And we could do some little things. So we could do some TV shows. Just pull some of these ones off. We have a TV on Monday. I still get excited when it comes to Monday. I'm like, oh, Game of Thrones. Nope. It's finished. It's not on. And it's not going to be on for like another year. I need to get into another TV program. I'm nearly at the end of Scandal, so I want to find something else. We started watching Deadliest Catch again. We used to watch it forever ago, and then we stopped watching it, but now we're kind of getting back into it. But yeah, I need to find something. I've kind of watched Gossip Girl and Grey's Anatomy, and I'm trying to think what else we've watched. Vampire Diaries, the originals. I just need a new series to get into. I haven't watched, was it Making a Murderer? Or Getting Away with Murder? I can't remember what it was called. Um, I haven't watched any of those. Uh, but I've heard people have said it's actually quite good. An Amer American Horror Story, I watched the, uh, I think it was the first season. Um, and then I didn't watch the next season because people said it wasn't very good anyway. But maybe I should just kind of watch that. And I was watching Devious Maids, even though it's quite an old um, programme. But I was watching it on Now TV, and I think I had two s series to go, I think. And then it was taken off of Now TV, and I'm like, really? I still had, like, loads to go. And I kind of miss it, because it was a programme that I could put on and didn't really have to like watch everything to keep up I could just listen to it while I was either designing or kind of doing my own thing but having that on in the background and now I can't watch it and it's kind of irritating because I really liked it so I'm gonna have to see if I can maybe buy the box set or something just so I can watch the like last two series okay so that's all of the Oh, hello. That's all of the um, TVs and the dinners down. So let's do some icons. Oh, there's a cleaning day. We could have a cleaning day sticker. And we can do that on... Hmm. Uh, we can do that on Tuesday. And there is a payday wallet. And we can have that on Wednesday. This little coffee sticker here says, This coffee is almost as hot as my beard. I thought that was really funny. Because uh, men with beards are just, like, obsessed. I think men's beards are like women's brows. You know, they take some time and they're kind of proud of them when they get them. Right. So I'm going to put that... Oh, I don't know where to put that. Uh... Mm -hmm. I'm going to put that down here. No, I'll put it down here. Okay, let's do the sidebar before I get carried away and use everything up. So I'm going to use the, it's called Style, and I'm going to put a bit of washi behind it. I could use the same washi actually that I used up here. I got excited because I found my Hobbycraft card. I haven't even used it, so let me use it. I also need to buy some more washi. I feel my washi stash is dwindling down. Oh. Okay. 
and I'm just going to use my card. Should I do it right up to the edge then? No, we won't. We'll do it to here. And then grab this full box. And just put it up here. Oh. Hmm. That kind of did not work. crooked but you know what that's fine and I'm going to put my habit trackers down so I will put one here and then some washi in between I use this grey one and the other one I'm just going to layer that a little bit uh, what else do I normally put on the side one? Oh, a weekly box with a header, so we could have a mm, a work header. Put that one down here. And the weekly box. Down here. And then I'm just going to cut this washi because it's kind of irritating me. I went all the way to the edge because the top washi is like that but I don't like it now. <laughs> so I'm just going to trim the end off so I can pick it up. Come on. There we go. Much better. Um, okay. Then I'm going to use the patterned washi down here as like a half box, I think, yeah. It's like a little man with his little bow tie. I'll just grab all of those. Put them down here. Once I have finished filming this, I'm going to go ahead and put this kit up into the shop while I edit this and upload it onto YouTube. I've kind of been a bit quiet lately on um, social media, so I apologise for that. I need to get back into posting onto Instagram and Twitter. I just like talking to you guys on Facebook and things like that, because I kind of missed it. It's just that, I don't know, I've just been kind of silent for the last few days. Um, I'm also going to put a... I need to put something down here. Mm, I could put another checklist. Oh, I'll put the to buy. Wherever that has gone, I've lost it, here it is. I'm going to put the to buy right at the bottom. That way if you've got anything to buy over the week, you can just write it in there. Okay, going back to my deco, so we've got a little watch here, which I'm probably going to be putting these up here, so I'm going to put the watch up there, I've got the little drinking flask, I'll put that here. Uh, the smaller deck I'm going to try and put up here. So I've got some cufflinks. I've got a cigar. I actually really like the smell of cigars. I know that that's actually probably weird. Um, but yeah. <laughs> I've got some shoes. Uh, let's put them up there. I've got the keys. And we'll put them here. And then I've got all of these ties, which I might actually put along some of these um, check boxes. So I might put one there. And I can't get them off. There we go. Got one here. I 
kind of small. That one there, and then the last one right at the end. Yeah. Okay. Um, I've also got a little bow tie and a scarf. So let's pop them in somewhere. I'm going to pop the little bow tie over here. And then the scarf. I am going to put... Hmm. I'll put the scarf down here maybe. I've got a belt and a shaving brush. So we're going to put the shaving brush up here and then the little belt we will put here. Okay, I think that's most of that deco. So let's put a, hmm, we'll put a Bill Jew down. And we'll put that down on the Wednesday. And we will also put down a quarter box. And then we'll put a little icon on there. And we'll say that we are um, filming on that day. And then we can put a half box down, a solid half box on Thursday. That is wonky, but that's what it is. And then we'll put a little laptop sticker down to say that we are working. I'm going to have to make that box, I'm sorry guys. Let's try that again. There we go. And we can say that we are working. And then, hmm, we could put a little page flag in on the Saturday, and we are uh, having a haircut, and then we can put another page flag down, we'll put a small grey one. I'll put that right there. With a little shopping trolley uh, basket. And then a another one down here. Whoops. To say that we had to get petrol. Oh, they're all the same icon, I just realised, but never mind. That's okay. Um, let's use the last marbly full box right in the... Do I want to put it in the middle? Yeah, I'm going to put it in the middle because I've already set it down. And we are also going to be putting a little alarm clock in here. Like that. A little film slate one. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Okay. I think we are done. I'm just going to put a little page bag in this one. Right there. Okay, let me just get up my sheets. Okay, so that is pretty much it, I think, for this mock plan with me so I hope you guys have enjoyed it I hope you guys really like this kit and if there are any male planners out there then I hope you guys appreciate the kit too I actually really love the colour scheme that I've done in here it's not too heavy especially with the light grey and the light blues and I also like the way that I've managed to do the full boxes and all of the deco without it being too I've got lots of males in my planner so um, yeah, I hope you guys really enjoy this. If you do, then make sure you give me a thumbs up on my video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for mock plan with me's that come out on a Friday when I have a new kit and also usual plan with me's that come up on a Monday. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys all next week on Monday. Have a good weekend. Bye guys.